back of the cab and back of the truck. On your paper, you notice how it's got coupling in the middle? Yeah. Uh, don't do coupling until you're done with form B. Separate form B and coupling, because a lot of people, they'll go through, they'll start B and then go into coupling and go back into B. Well, if they get A and coupling, they won't know where coupling starts and form B ends. So. Gotcha. So always separate those two. All right, so form B. I'm gonna do a general overview of the side of my truck. There's nothing cracked, damaged, loose. There's nothing leaking under my truck. All my lights, lenses, and reflectors are not cracked, damaged, loose, and proper color and clean. I have my door opens and shuts properly, and it's not cracked, damaged, loose. You will do this on the state test. So the door is unlocked, so make sure you open and shut it. Because also you got to point to your hinges. They're not cracked, damaged, loose. Uh, when you guys point to things on the side of the truck, don't be banging it. With the You'll be chipping the paint. If Ricky sees it, ooh, Ricky's going to get good to your eyes. <laughs> All right, my mirror. It's not cracked, damaged, or loose. It's properly adjusted and clean. My steps are not cracked, damaged, or loose. I'm come back here. Step here so you guys can see. My fuel tank is not cracked, damaged, or loose, or leaking. My fuel cap. It's not cracked, damaged, or loose. It's not leaking. And the rubber seal on the inside has no abrasions, bumps, or cuts. Right here. My exhaust down here is not cracked, damaged, or loose. It's not leaking. Signs of leaking will be soot around the clamps. My drive shaft is not cracked, damaged, or loose. It's not bent. My U joints. My U-joints are not cracked, damaged, or loose. They're properly greased and no signs of excessive wear. So I'm gonna do a general overview of the back of the cab. There's not, nothing cracked, damaged, or loose. All my lights, lenses, and reflectors are the proper color and clean and they're not cracked, damaged, or loose. My catwalk is not cracked, damaged, or loose. My frame is not cracked, damaged, or loose. No signs of illegal welds. When you guys go in doing the back uh, back of the cab, go ahead and step over in here because you can see all the parts right here. Cool. When you're when you're out from the outside, them tires they hide everything. They hide everything. So we kind of step up in here and look. All right. So I got my axle. It's not cracked, damaged, or loose. It's not leaking. My torque arm is not cracked, damaged, or loose. All right. My frame bracket, eye bolt, control arm, and U bolts are not cracked, damaged, or loose. Uh, sign of loose on my U bolts be shiny metal metal shavings. My upper shock mount, lower shock mount, and my shock are not cracked, damaged, or loose. The shock is not leaking. My air brake hose. It's not cracked, damaged, loose, no abrasion, bumps, or cuts. It's not leaking. My brake chamber, push rod, and slack adjuster. It's not cracked, damaged, loose. Brake chamber is not leaking. My slack adjuster has no more than one inch of play with the brakes released. Brake drum and brake pad. It's not cracked, damaged, loose, no illegal welds, no oil or grease. And my brake pad is less, no less than a quarter inch pad. All four sides of my rim, internet of rims, are not cracked, damaged, or loose. Uh, no illegal welds, no oil or grease. All four sidewalls of my tires have no abrasions, bumps, or cuts. They are properly seated to the rim and they're not leaking. I have a minimum of three inches between the tires and no debris. The top of tires have no abrasions, bumps, or cuts. They're not leaking. They have no uneven wear, a minimum of two 30 seconds tread. Uh, they can be recaps, they can be mismatched, but they must be the same size. My lug nuts are not cracked, damaged, or loose. They're not missing. Signs of looseness will be rust streaks, shiny metal, metal shavings. Both my valve stems are not cracked, damaged, or loose. They're not leaking. I have a minimum of 100 PSI and I checked that with the air gauge. 
You do have to point to both valve stems. There's two valve stems? Yep, you got two tires. So you got one valve stem here, and the other valve stem will be directly across from it. Oh, okay. So you got to balance the tires out. My wheel hub seal. It's not cracked, damaged, loose, it's not leaking, and it's filled to the proper operating level. Upper and lower airbag mount. It's not cracked, damaged, or loose. My airbag has no abrasions, bumps, or cuts, and it is not leaking. My frame. It's not cracked, damaged, or loose. No signs of illegal welds. I would check this axle, same as I checked my first axle, except this one has an ABS wire. So, yep. Yeah, so your back axle will always have the ABS wire. My mud flap, mud flap hanger is not cracked, damaged, or loose. A minimum of six to eight inches off the ground. Back here. All my lights, lenses, and reflectors are not cracked, damaged, or loose. And they're proper color and clean. Form B. Any questions? Sure.